This video will demonstrate how to install the marker plugin, create a marker in the model, and print out the markers to be used on site. Markers are created and managed within Trimble Connect using the Trimble Connect marker extension. Whoever is responsible for creating and managing the marker network will need to install the Trimble Connect marker extension. To begin, open the model in Connect. Open the settings and choose the extensions menu. Click the add button and then click the advance button to open the additional input fields. Input the following details. Title, the plugin application, and the icon URL. After the information is entered, click Add to complete the extension installation. Once the Trimble Connect Marker extension is installed, it will be available within Trimble Connect Web when any 3D model is loaded. A key workflow to enable quick and accurate placement of models on site is to establish a QR marker network. These markers provide a link between a known location in the model and the real world. Digital representations of the markers are created within the model. A PDF printout of each marker is downloaded and then installed in the corresponding real-world location. The Connect AR application has been developed with the intent that a network of markers is established around the construction site. Once this network is established, then any field user can easily use the app and position the model without requiring extensive training. Markers must be installed on a flat vertical surface. Sloping or horizontal placement of markers is not supported. The markers should be flat and securely fastened on all four sides. Any wrinkles or curvature of the marker may adversely impact model alignment. The markers can be laminated to provide protection from water or dampness. We recommend placing markers with as much clear, flat space around them as possible as opposed to right at the edge of a corner or surface. This will ensure optimal performance. Immediately after scanning a marker to place a model, the model should be very well aligned and accurately located. However, as you move around and the further away from the marker you get, you will see the digital model will drift out of alignment with the real world. This is completely normal and reflects the present limitations of this type of visualization technology. The extent of this drift will vary depending on the device you are using. The more recent the device model, the less drift you should expect to see. To manage this drift, it is recommended to establish a network of markers around your job site. These can be placed in critical locations, such as service risers or plant rooms or more generally, around the job site depending on your needs. As a general guideline, we recommend operating within 5 to 10 meters of a marker. So markers placed every 10 to 15 meters should prove sufficient. To create a marker on the model, sign in to Trimble Connect. Choose the desired region and click on the project name. Select the model file. After the model has been opened, tap the marker symbol to open the marker list space. Any markers previously created will be visible in this list. Use the clipping tool to set a customized view to locate where to place a new marker. To create a new marker, tap the Add Marker button. Tap a position on an object to position the new marker. Markers must be placed on a vertical surface and spaced every 5 to 15 meters. 
Once the marker has been placed, use the measure tool to locate the bottom left corner of the marker. These measurements will be used on site to place the physical marker in the same location as the marker in the model. Tap the ellipses next to the marker to edit. In the description box, add the measurements to the marker. When the description is complete, press Save. To download all markers, tap Download All. To download an individual marker, tap the ellipses next to the marker and tap Download as PDF. Open the PDF and notice that the dimensions are added to the bottom of the marker. The marker aligns with the measurements at the bottom corner of the QR code. It is important to always print in 100% scale. The next video in the series demonstrates and explains the process of working with markers in Connect AR.